British street artist Banksy appears to have given his hometown a gift just in time for Valentine's Day. The mural shows a small girl with a slingshot and a splatter of red flowers. It's on the side of a house in Bristol, England, a city about two hours west of London. As Crystal Gomansing explains, Banksy's art often plays with elements of darkness and joy, and this piece is no different. Marsh Lane is getting a whole lot of love. We were just working around the corner and then um, someone was saying that, oh, God, there's a new Banksy around the corner. So, uh, yeah, just immediately spunking off work. Surely lots of people left work early to see the new Banksy and more will be flocking to this Bristol, England neighbourhood, although some worry how the piece will fare with the storm in the forecast. A lovely surprise, really nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just driving down the road to go and do some shopping. And there it was. So I had to stop and have a look. It's just amazing. Amazing, yes, but is it about love? It did appear on Banksy's Instagram page on the 14th. Bristol is reportedly his home, but little is known about one of the most recognizable names in street art. We do know he is a master at making people gasp. Remember this? Banksy is one of a kind, you know, but he's not the be all end all. You know, he's a, he's a very clever artist, I guess, for his messages. Self expression fills every inch at Leak Street or Banksy Tunnel. In 2008, the space under Waterloo Station was transformed by the mysterious painter when he hosted the Cannes Festival. Banksy's work can be found all over, including around the corner from the Global News London Bureau. We went to the Banksy exhibition down, down west and when they had the Dismal Land and we were just driving past and saw, saw everyone here so we thought we'd stop and have a look. A long gaze and a few pictures. Maybe the point of this Valentine's Day Banksy is to get people to spend time together doing something that costs nothing. Crystal Gamance in Global News, London.